In today's adventure, I'm teaming up with Dozing Chopper, Barbarius, and Frankie on PC, and we're going to be heading up deep into the mountains of Deer Isle to set up one of the most unique bases we've ever come up with. The area we chose to settle in seemed quiet at first, but we soon found that a clan was living deep in the mountains right beneath our noses, and we were going to have to go to war with them. Would we be able to raid and take over our enemy's bunker, or would we fail miserably, losing it all? All of these questions and more will be answered, but first we have to go back to where the story really starts, and this time, it's not at the coast. This one starts off in the sky. To give you some backstory, we had been on the server for about a week and we had a pretty successful run, but it all came crashing down when we got raided overnight and lost all of our stuff. Now the raiders didn't end up finding our helicopter because we hid this on a separate island away from our base, so we still had that going for us. Anyways, that's what brought us up to the point that we're at now. We flew our helicopter up north towards the swamp, which was a popular area, in the hopes that we would find some cheap bases that we could raid into, and hopefully even find some building supplies so that we could rebuild ourselves. And after searching the forest for quite a while, we found our first target. There's a bunker here, yeah. Fucking camo. You don't have any food, I take it. This guy, man. <laughs> Dude, I shit you not, last time I traded, I bought three pork down the mall. I'm zero food. Nah, do the MREs, bro. Pork does not yeah. man. What do you mean? It's a can of pork, bro. It does nothing. <laughs> We're in, I think. Should be done. All right, man. You first, or do we go first? Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, cute little tent. Oh, you know what? I'm seeing a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Our first raid was a success, and although this bunker wasn't loaded, we were able to get the things that we needed, including some nails and some other base building supplies. This gear was probably enough for us to build a new base, but we still wanted to use our heli and look around for a few more spots. Base here, bro. Where? Right here, the castle. I said the tower. I see that, I do see that. Hold on. You can put me through a window, man. Yeah, literally. Like, I can get out onto that window, I swear to God I can. Yeah, I mean, I can try, yeah. We've done it before. Oh, you're in. Uh, tsh, there's a door, tier one door. Uh, I got a sledge. Oh, no, no, wait, it's a wooden frame, it says tier one. Problem is, there's another one right behind it. Oh, wait, no! What? Why is it flowing? It's just flowing, <laughs> you get out of the alley and it flew away? Dude, it's like just hovering. Oh, nah. It'll come down. It'll come down, I think. Give it a second. It's coming down. It's coming down. It's coming down. This is gate stack so heavy, dude. Yeah, we just kept how much? There, no, I think there's going to be a higher window, man. Surely. I get to the top, get flagged. I'm in, I'm in. I think that's loot, right? Yeah, this is loot right here. I might be able to like actually dismantle that. It's a trash. Like, surely I could pick that up, you know? There's a guy like underneath right now. Gear? Nah. Nah, he's a freshie. He's at the car. Yeah, I know. Does he not like see us? I don't know. I guess no. He's in his own planet. I'm trying to find out what that sound is, but I can't seem to find him. Yeah, literally. <laughs> watching him right now. Dismantle. Yes! Oh my oh. god. Get the okay, what you need to do, dismantle the flag. Yeah, I'm gonna get you guys in. And then, uh, yeah, from the roof. Okay, I'm gonna pick up the first one. Uh, well, let's see. I don't know if I'm at flag yet, you know what I mean? I'm at flag. I'm packing a sleeping bag. Give me a sec. What are you gasping for, man? I'm not gonna touch anything. Just get in here, man. Get in here. Let's just say, check the sleeping bag there, folks. Oh, this guy's running right past it. Oh, oh wow. I can't right. see. I can't see. Oh my god, bro. These guys are actually juiced. Taking a peek. Taking a peek. A lot of car keys in there. A lot. This base was absolutely loaded with barter tools, building supplies, and even a few raid tools that we could use later on. With this, we would definitely have enough to rebuild our base, and we would even have a good amount of cash after we sold everything that we got here. From here, Baba, Chopper, and I got onto the helicopter and made our way to the outpost to meet up with Frankie and plan our next steps. Okay, so what's, what's our plan right now? Are we gonna just move up north towards the mountains and see what we get into? Yeah, exactly. I think we try and secure the um, the house we want to build in and then go from there. 
So we're hmm. going to ah. the like north of Waldo, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright. Yeah. Um, you can make an underground base. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so we really? did that just before when we were playing. Yeah. You're gonna like this one, man. And it's, it's it's a pretty cool mod. Dude, I'm I'm like <laughs> I've been out of it for so long. It's like what what the fudge? It came a long way. Yeah, it, really, it seems to have. Yeah. Ready? No. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Set up. Oh, watch out, wolves! Oh, oh wolves! Oh, no. Straight off the bat. Oh, no. I can't raise my gun. Oh, how'd you? Wait, what? <laughs> There's wolves attacking us. <laughs> <laughs> So Frankie, so you, so you look caught up. You see where the lake kind of goes over towards like the cliff edge, to the left. Yeah, that's kind of where we want to build, just underneath there. Oh, and the little river, the outlet yeah. that goes out. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Do you seriously not fall down this hill? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! No, don't fall, don't fall. Famous oh last God. words. <laughs> As we were saying. What is this? I ran over your head, chopper. Oh. With our plan in action, we made our way up to the mountains to find a spot for our starter base location. For the starter, we wanted to just dig a hole in the ground and set up a temporary bunker until we found a better spot to set up the main base. Yeah, find a concealed spot. Like, I feel like this is flat enough, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's flat enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that works. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, is it right in the fence? I think it'll be fine. I think <laughs> it's going to be fine. It should yeah. be okay. It should be okay. Yeah, yeah. I have no building qualifications, right? Like. <laughs> There we go. Hey! Perfect hey. spot for a hatch. There she is. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, I don't know yeah. if we're gonna get any building commissions after this, but like Yeah, uh, I don't know about that one, but like, it's, <laughs> it's not much, but it's home. Uh, like, yeah, it's definitely not much, I can assure you. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's nice though, it's not too bad. After Frankie finished building the bunker, we set up our sleeping bags and sorted out the rest of our gear. Now, if you remember, I told you that we got raided earlier on and that was true, but we didn't lose everything because when we were logged out, we had all of our C4 on us. So although we did lose a lot of base building supplies, we still had our raiding tools. But anyways, we put our C4 away for now and we took out our purple keycard, which gave us access to a massive bunker right up the mountain from us. I'll start the farm, man. Start growing tomatoes, selling those. We can make a little cafe, <laughs> you know? Nazar's famous sliced tomato sandwiches. <laughs> like they're gonna like sell our hotcakes. They they will. He'll, he'll get the. Fish. I'm Africa's great. My best friend's girlfriend is uh, Namibian. The wildlife and stuff is apparently crazy over there. Yeah, just baboons crossing. This. You should drive out of the airport. There's just baboons on the on the side That's of the street. That's crazy. Yeah. Like yeah, and they're clever. They they know not to get in the way of the cars, and they like hold back the young. You know, like humans would. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's weird. That's kind of cool. And if you go camping, they often take a gun because baboons like smell the meat and stuff. You're having a braai like a barbecue. And if you point a, a gun at the baboons, they'll duck. Like oh, they know really? what it is. Yeah, yeah, they'll duck and like like zigzag to get out of the way. So kind of it's, 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 it's like uncanny intelligence because no animal like in this country at least has that kind of intelligence. Yeah, yeah. They just stand there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh -oh. Hey. Oh, no. No, yeah, this is like... where we got ambushed. Yeah, literally, they were up in the rafters here. All right, Frankie. Open oh, sesame. Nothing. Wait. No, 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 no. That's the best gun. That's like the best gun in the server. Wait, what's the what's fix? Say? My Q. The fix? Oh my god. This mountain facility was a bit of a maze, but after doing some exploring, we found an abandoned hospital with a few more crates inside that had some guns and some more good gear. Okay. Wrist watch. I'm taking that. That was about to yoink that, literally. <laughs> I, I had my cursor yeah, over yeah, yeah. that, like, literally. I was like, ah, screw the guns. And you're wearing <laughs> it on your wrist as well. Yeah, yeah, you can check it out. It's on the ground. That is pretty cool, though. After looting the entire compound, we made our way back off the mountain and down towards our base to deposit our loot. So Wait, isn't there a guy? There's a guy right here. Where? What? Uh, right side of the river. Like, he's on the. Oh, there. yeah, I see him. I can't we like, shoot him, but... Wait, aren't yeah, we, we near our base? Should we go talk yeah, to him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see if we can talk to him, yeah. Yeah, because like, there's, there's no risk to like talking to him. He's right next yeah, to us. Yeah, which one? What is he on the mountain? Oh, I see him. Yeah, yeah. Let's go see. He's by himself. Looks like he's just exploring, though. Just saved that yeah. guy's life, didn't I? Like, like I literally <laughs> just saved that guy's life. You guys were like... <laughs> I was scoping in, thank God it was dark. <laughs> no, just... It's instinct, man. It's just instinct. <laughs> Hello? 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 He's just uh, absolutely bricking himself right now. On the way back home, it was strange to see a mysterious figure sitting on the cliffs looking down at our base because this spot was so remote and we never usually see people over here. 
We tried following this guy to talk to him, but he quickly lost us and we never ended up finding out where he went or getting any information about him. It was creepy knowing that there could be people watching us at this very minute and we weren't the only ones out here. Maybe there was other bases around. Hey! Oh, dude. <laughs> That's nice. Now this yeah. is home. That's what <laughs> that is. That's what we needed. Four gillies, oh, one okay. trapdoor. Like, that's that's <laughs> this story. <laughs> Once back at base, Frankie ended up logging out for the day, and now it was just Baba, Chopper, and I. We were still going to be on for a few hours, so we took this time to head up towards the research facility on the mountain to check it out for some supplies. Oh, there's a base down here. Really? Oh, in the bunker. Oh, yeah. You want to investigate it, see what it's looking like? Yeah, I think so, yeah. I think that's a good plan. Wait, there's a guy there. Where? There's a guy prone there inside. That's far in my life. <laughs> yeah, I do see him. Is, is there a guy or is it a bug? It is a guy. No, no, it's a guy. It's a guy. Because he's armed. I'll watch him from here. What are we thinking here? Do I put him down? Yeah, he's AFK. He's AFK. Have you, have you got rope? That's a good question. No. Nah, man. I can knock him out with my fist. Got fall. up. He woke up. No. No. <laughs> it didn't have to be like that. What is he doing here? Just laying there. Okay, they blocked that downstairs too. Wait. Oh. What? This guy locked in. He's on con. He's on con. Wait, is it? No, he's there. He's there. He's there. Uh. What? Did he just log on you? He fucking loaded in. He just yeah. logged in. He just logged in. Yeah. What? What's going on today? This is a vehicle in here, hundred percent. This is a garage. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah, hundred percent. Almost guaranteed. I wonder how deep down their main base goes then. Yeah, that's a good question. This was the first base that we identified in our area. Maybe this belonged to the guy that we saw on the cliff earlier on, or maybe it was a completely different group. Either way, remember this location because we'll be coming back here in the future. Oh, oh, guy in front of us. One more. He's hurt. He's lit. He did. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. One more. Good one, dead. Good one. Good one. One more. One more. I gotta reload. I don't see him. Yeah, neither. I'm fucking lit right now. You think he's above us? Uh, yeah, I think so. Like, I think he's just gonna be sitting. Did you spray a uh, SV98? Like, at the end there? I sprayed ARX and killed a guy. Yeah, didn't you hear like an a ace valve spray like right at the end? I heard shots, yeah, that's what I'm saying. There's another guy, 100%. Has to be. Yeah, this guy's level 5 armor. Coming, coming. He's up here. Depressed uh, sniper. Is he on the platform? I'm not sure. He's bad. I was just healing and he missed. He's in the school. I just heard him. Can you chill on my body for now? And then we can push this together. Yeah, you're good. He's on the roof, bro. He just looked down on me. He was on the roof. Oh, that was clean on top. I don't know if that got him. Well, there's a guy on our bodies. He's, he's looting right now. I hear him. I hear him. Yeah, they're literally right above me. Like, I hear them. One dead. On me. Dead, dead, dead. Nice. One on me, dead. I killed, I nice, killed one nice. as well. That's three dead, right? Uh, I killed yeah, I one. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three I killed. Dead. Three, yep. dead. three dead. Oh, yeah. Wow, he's loaded, dude. That's what I'm saying. We should definitely double carry that. I'm gonna go um, unlock three or two now and see what we find. It's not the best one I've ever seen, but. Uh, no, it's not. But yeah, you know, we take it. Better than nothing. Oh, he's right in front of me. What? Oh, shit. What's that? Right, he's crossing this bit right now. Two guys, two guys, kid. Oh, shit, yeah. I missed, I missed. Oh, oh my god. Where is he? He's aiming at me, he's aiming at me. Yeah, he's just got a blaze. There's one on the rocks. Hey, one? I'm push this guy. He's hurt. One close to you is hurt. Yeah. I'm coming behind him now if you give me a minute. 
Killed this guy. That guy's at the rocks across. Oh yeah, him. You'll, you'll be right behind him in a sec. He's running away. He's running away. Okay. Oh yeah, I saw you a bullet splash. Uh, did he go right? He's, uh, he's in the fence. He's low. He's done. Nice, boys. Up if you need to. Dude, 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 dude. That guy, that guy's coming. What guy's coming? <laughs> He's talking about me? Oh, who's coming? <laughs> Just drop your shit, see what you got, man. We're not gonna take too much. Alright, man, you can pick up the rest yeah, okay. of it. Don't worry about it. Use your gun back, man. Just don't shoot us. Otherwise, it'll be bad. I don't think I stand the chance if I shoot. Yeah, yeah alright, man. Well, good luck to you, alright, buddy? Bye. Good luck, soldier. Greenville. Maybe extract and try and do that? Nah. Yep. We ran down south to Greenville as fast as possible to try and contest this airdrop, but we would soon find out that another team had beaten us to it. Oh. What? There's a mozzy here. Cairo. Oh. That's probably the one we saw. Oh, he's on me. Where is he, Baba? He's in the compound. I'm getting dogged on. Oh, yeah, it's him pushing. He's up. Uh, come back. Yeah, you're good. I'm just gonna chill. I killed him. Corner, yeah. yeah, good shot. Nice. There's another Freshie somewhere. I think this is our base. It is, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I killed the Freshie. I'm good. Okay, I'm just gonna loot him quickly heal. before we start. Oh, 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 watch out, watch out. You good? I'm gonna continue looting. That guy almost uh, caught us off guard. Wait, hold on. I got the gyro keys. I got the gyro keys. Ah! You gotta go, dog. Oh, if we could secure this heli, that's big, man. Like, damn, I have another key. That's starts in about. 60 seconds, so let's chill. Yep, open door. Kill him. Okay, here we go. Oh, no. It's over. It's over. It's over. Five million in my pocket right there. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> it's literally five million dollar heli. Pissed all dickheads over there. Shitting me. Oh, really? Yeah, that's yeah, fine. Though, don't worry. He's dead. Oh, no, he's not. Now he is. We had caught this group heading back home from the airdrop, and unfortunately for them, they had forgotten their helicopter keys in their pocket, giving us a free helicopter. We took the helicopter to the outpost and changed out the keys, and then we flew it back home up in the mountains to park it and figure out what we were going to do next. We parked our heli far away from our base so that nobody would track us back, and on the way back home, we stumbled upon something strange. I need to get some water, man. Uh, I got some. Oh! What? Fucking base here. Wait, what? What? I've literally never seen this on Dural. Yeah, I've never even seen this. Whoa, wait. wait, our base is literally right here, bro. What the fuck? Yeah, we should probably boom this. I'm not gonna lie. Ah. Uh, how much? How much boom do we have? Like. We got all enough, bro, right, for sure. But and... we need to boom enough. Yeah. Oh dear. It's like right next to our base. Uh, it could be gate stacked. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Dude, how do we not see this? Like, it's right next to our base, yeah? Well, we never really, like, checked. Like, we ran here, but I feel like it was darker, and, like, we didn't really check. Like, I've never seen this spot in Dero. Yeah, like... I've never. So we happened to run into a mountainside base, only a 20-second run from where we had our bunker. This was the first time we had seen a location like this, and I've been playing Gear Isle for probably four years now, and I never knew this existed. Since this base was right next to us and it had a tier 3 door, we saw this as a threat. They could raid us at any minute, so we went back home to grab some of our C4 to see if we could make a dent in their base. I just hope it's not like some gate stack tunnel, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, that would be a problem. Okay, we're good. I don't even hear it. It's beeping, that's for sure. Did it blow? Yeah. Oh, oh, it blew. Oh, Back. it's backwards. Yeah, I wish we could dismantle. We got homemades. You guys hear that? Yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, that one's bugged out for me. Yeah, it's probably just, just a weird bug. <laughs> she looking like... Oh, it's three. Damn. Okay, that's not so good. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got, we got plenty for two, three. Okay. We just need to go there with a the safe zone now. Oh. Oh. God dang it. Yeah. Yeah. I wish you could dismantle, man. Yeah, it's going to be good stack. I think this is it after this, so I could be wrong, but like, I, I feel like that's it. We had already wasted a decent amount of C4 on this base, but we couldn't stop now. We had to be close to getting in. We still had some leftover explosives, but in order to use them, we were going to have to head to Trader and buy the required components to put them together. So Chopper and Baba flew over there to do that while I held this base in case the owners came back. Someone's outside. No way. I'm holding. That's all you, brother. Uh, I traded. He inst he like knew I was in the corner. Like he pre-fired me. Yeah, you got a gun and bass. You got a gun and bass. Up spawn. Yeah, I am. I'm running. Just one. Just one guy. Oh, nice man. Huge. Oh yeah, he was on a loot run. He's loaded. What's his name? Zach. Never heard of him. Me neither. Me neither. Man, this better work. Oh. 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 Wow. What's she looking like in here, though? Hey, yeah, she's got some stuff. That's for sure. Oh yeah, I'm already seeing some uh, decent stuff right here. And there's some fuel. Uh. Dude, look at these uh, gear stands too. Bear pelts and sellables. My God, they're actually loaded. There's a bunker. Oh yeah. Dude, thank God Frankie built this on the fence. I can find it every time. I just follow the fence line. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. Strangely enough, this cave base had a bunker inside. So I ran back to base to quickly grab a hacksaw and then I went back to raid into it. That's I think we, I think we take this over, honestly. We should. This is so nice. Like, yeah. look at look at how it's all set up. All the storage yeah. in here too. Half the stuff's in there for us. We gate stack it properly. We set up the farm. Which is good. All right. Going in. Yeah. Oh, oh my! Oh, look, my. Dude, look at the guns, oh. there, buddy. Keys. Oh yeah, that's oh, concrete. Nice. That's big too. That's nice. Wait, Mercedes. These guys have a lot of keys, man. For like everything. Look, yeah, you seeing that? Look at the guns, buddy. Where? Oh, right here. Oh, that's fucking stacked. Wait, these are good guns. This like the fixes and nah. Fall into the map, man. I'm really low. Wait a minute. Now these guys were pretty stacked, but interestingly enough, we didn't find any C4. This is quite common because people will log out with it, but still we expected to find at least something left over. Now this was all about to change because as you heard Baba say, he glitched out and fell through the map, which made him have to re-log. But as he was falling through the map, he saw something very interesting. So as you can see, Baba spotted some tier 3 concrete doors floating right outside of the bunker that we were in. Now this was strange because there was no bunker there, these were simply floating in the sky and it wasn't something we had ever seen before. But the other more important thing that we noticed was that there were also storages there and these could have a lot of good stuff. Now I guess to give you some info, these are underground bunkers but the way the mod works is that they're actually spawned in the sky when you dig into the ground because in Daisy you can't actually let go under the terrain. So that's why you see the sky. But anyways, we saw that there were storages floating right outside of where we were and there wasn't any other bunker leading to them, at least not in the cave or anywhere outside. We checked everywhere. So we weren't really sure what happened here, but then Chopper came up with an idea of what might have occurred. Okay, so I had a funny feeling. Maybe you can turn it back from tier 3 to tier 2 to hide it. So I took the shovel to upgrade base and now look in the inventory. Oh my god, that is genius that but is yeah genius. no that's a bug though that's definitely a bug we rated einstein bro i'm you're big brain dude yeah <laughs> they need to accept you to oxford <laughs> oxford's calling you they'll just upgrade it for like you know five minutes do what they have to do un upgrade it and they leave it like this half like most of the time that's all yeah. they do yeah i think so yeah they're gonna be loaded bro 
They're actually gonna be loaded. But it, it is kind of like abusing it, I guess, but. That is like 100% abusing it. They, they have like unaccessible storage unless you build something for it. And we wouldn't have even known if he didn't like glitch through and foul. That's the crazy part. We pretty much came to the conclusion that whoever lived here must have upgraded this underground bunker to a tier 3 concrete bunker, which was much larger, and then they somehow found a way to revert this to a tier 2 when they were locked out. This way, anybody who raided them would only raid the tier 2 and never realize that there was a bunch of storage floating right outside. To test our theory, we got some sheet metal and upgraded this back to a tier 3, but it turned out we were partially wrong. There wasn't any storages in the upgraded version, and the boxes we saw on the other doors were still floating outside in the sky. So we ended up calling an admin over to check it out and they confirmed that it was some type of exploit or bug that they hadn't ever seen before. So it's got to be like some kind of exploit I think so I'm just gonna pick a bunch of shit up from down there and just drop it to you guys because that's got to be some kind of weird, weird exploit that I haven't figured out yet but yeah, if I figure uh, it out so I'll too. make a rule against it or I don't even know yeah. but I'll just I'll just drop whatever I'm I sure, can find out of the I'm sure they'll make a shit. ticket at some point. You're probably wondering why I'm even explaining all of this, and it's mainly because these guys had unreadable storage that they somehow, in a clever way, managed to glitch out. And when the admin went and got all of their unreadable stuff, they had a lot of C4. And let's just say these boys were not going to be too happy that we figured out their trick, and they would probably come back and try to take this base back over. But we would have to see. For the time being, we basically broke even with all the C4 that we used to get in here, so we were pretty happy with that, and we had a new base that we could build up. We spent the rest of the evening setting up more doors and sorting the base out, and then we logged out for the night, hoping that our home would still be there the following day. Dude, it's uh, it's war, it's bro. A war. It's a fucking war. We're about to get raided. What do you mean it's a war? So we loaded in. Um, then when we loaded in, um, we teleported outside the base. There's a guy inside of our base, so they raided the first part. Yeah. Oh shit, so I'm about to load it on somebody? No, 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 you're in the bunker, right? But basically, yeah, you're, now you're, there's like two squads fighting in our base. There's two squads fighting? Yeah. Oh, I'm in the bunker. Fine. Okay, perfect. What the fuck are they doing in our base, bro? We're living in the most remote area in the map. They're raiding it. Yeah, they were raiding it, bro. Oh, what, they get their party or something? Yeah, they're getting their party right now, by looks of it. Am I gonna have to go out there and get shifty right now? You may uh... have to. It could be the guys we raided, to be fair. I think it's the bunker guys, like southeast of us. You know that, um... Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, yeah. Before you push, let me know, because I'll go do in it, first. Do it now. Go, 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 go. Uh, I don't see anybody. He is, no, he's in there, 100%. I heard him. What? Dead, dead, dead. It just lagged so bad, dude. Yeah. One more outside, for sure. Oh, yeah. wow. They properly raided this. Yeah. Oh, C4 on this guy. Yeah, I yeah. knew it. Yep. What are the names? Nomad Rogue is a dog. This guy, he had a dog tag someone else. I'm going to take the C4 back in the bunker, okay? Yeah, yeah. Take, take everything good in the bunker I'm holding. Based on all of the bodies and dog tags I found, we could tell that there was probably two groups fighting for this base. And it seemed like one of the groups was the people that originally lived here. Fortunately, we logged in at the perfect time and were able to clear the base out and repel the attack. But we weren't safe yet. For now, I just grabbed as much stuff as I could and shuffled it into the bunker so that it was safe. And then I went back out to help the boys defend the base. They got crazy last night. What time did you play to? Uh, like eight hours ago, nine hours ago. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> Careful, bro. Oh, he's busted! Two dead, two dead. No, 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 it's a long story, but uh, oh, oh, oh. it looks like it's a long story. Uh, <laughs> Chopper, I need to reseal though because yeah, they yeah, have yeah. boom. That's actually yeah, a good yeah. show. Yeah, I'm yeah. gonna go reseal now. Yeah, yeah. That's um, there's wood in the ba uh, bunker. We need to figure yeah, out where they are. Yeah. 
Can you hold? I need to find... I'm holding, I'm holding. Yeah, he just ran by. It's pretty fresh. They're at the front door? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One hit. It's two, it's two. I mean, if you want to double key out, we can double key out. Maybe wait Frankie, just to have a third, because it would be better if we have a third person. Because it's better, I think, if we push and clear it, and then we rebuild, instead of just waiting for them to get gear. You guys cross? I got you, I got you. Yeah, he's holding it. I'm not even going to peek that. Yeah, don't, 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 don't. He's holding the left-hand side. He's, uh, right side. Uh, double key this side. Let's go, let's go. I'm going out, I'm going out, I'm going out. Oh, you killed him, you killed him. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Wow, well done. Good shooting, guys, good shooting. Really good. Well, I didn't do anything, but... Hey, you held, man. Good stuff. That's all we needed. <laughs> Alright. Oh! There's a guy by us! By us! By us! In the cave! In the cave! Where? Inside! Inside! Dad, 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 dad. What? Yeah. Okay, what? I'm respawning. I'm respawning. They live here. They live here. They live here. I'm back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He does, yeah. Oh, God. That's crazy, dude. Is that called lock on, man? Can you get another one up? I can. I, I definitely can. These guys were able to spawn inside the cave using sleeping bags, and it was a bit tricky to deal with, but somehow we were able to come out on top and fully repel the raid. Afterwards, we sealed off the base, and at that point, they couldn't get back inside. There was a small chance the raiders might come back and carry on the raid, so we waited around in our base for a bit, listening to the outside, but we didn't hear much, and we went outside and cleared it. Since it seemed like they gave up, we ran up north to our boat that we bought the day before, and made our way towards the lab to get some gear. Oh, our boat's here. I'm so happy. Let's you got a boat as well? Yeah, 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 we're gonna Good boat. Good job, today. All right. See where we go. Yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Oh. Ooh. Okay. So where's uh where's Red? He's downstairs. I think Red's it's got to be downstairs. Yeah. That's uh, here, right? Oh. Oh, it's got two crates in here. Three. Oh no, two, two, two. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Right. Let's see where we go in this one first. Oh. Oh. Yeah. That's yes. so much C4. Not as good as I thought it would be. Not great, not terrible. As we were leaving the lab's keycard rooms, we saw that there is an event being hosted up north at the swamp. This was quite far from us, but with the boat, we might be able to get there in time to claim it. Oh, there we go. Up here. Zombie aggro. Yeah, pity. Guarantee it. Okay, okay. Can't we just go from the roof of this old HQ and just walk across? That's what I'm thinking, yeah. Probably our best push. Let's try that. Yeah, I'm eating up into the roof now. Oh, got one guy. You good? Yeah, I right. just gotta go. Good job, good job. What's he doing? <laughs> he was just sitting here. He called me by surprise. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's just go. Let's just cross the PD. Careful. Yeah. I'll go in. Just gonna do a couple of kits. I'm better shot him. Ah, uh, he's hurt. He's hurt. He's kill dead. Him, kill him, kill him. Oh. Was that the Terminator? Yeah, that was Terminator. Oh. He's already dead. <laughs> and who's this guy? I don't know. Some random. I think that me. was the first guy that pushed. Yeah. Wait, that was a lot easier than I expected. <laughs> uh. I got the heli keys. Okay. Yeah. Oh! Oh! What? Oh! Come back inside the heli! Okay. Yeah. It's a good day. It's a very good day. How good of a day? Uh, maybe look inside. Oh, shit. Oh, that's a good event right there. Yes, Switching yeah. charges, AX50. Is AX50 the best gun? It is, yeah. Okay, it should. We gotta go, boys. I see a guy. Uh, window yeah. where we came in from. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. He's hit once. He's running right. He's went prone. Yeah, yeah. We're good. We're good to take off. Oh, yeah, just mind. take off, take off, take off. Then get it fast. 
Oh, Frankie's in. All right, get in, get in, boys. Quick, quick, quick. Okay, yeah, okay. Go. I'm on my way. I don't know if I hit that guy on the roof anyway. I'm in. Go, go, go. Get a jobber. We're off. We're well off. Did you, is he on the roof? Uh, I don't know where he is. Getting this heli was quite unexpected and we didn't really know what to do with it. So for now, we parked it on a remote island and then took our boat back home. Oh! I'm on con. He's dead. What? Oh I got him. There's a guy inside? Fucking jump scared me so bad. This guy. <laughs> yeah, there was a guy inside. This guy. He was literally waiting for us. This is We're actually going to have that problem forever. I know. Yeah, but you can't do anything. You can't get out. What's his name? Uh, Nomad Rogue. Yeah. Yeah, that's them. Um, He's been he's here for like him. 50 minutes. That's the dedication <laughs> of some days yeah. he plays. Oh my god, that's crazy. If we find out where he spawned, I'll put a box. Like, a like, box it was yeah, just build a the box there. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it should just be like right here, right? Where yeah, yeah, the yeah. bag is. It was great to see that our base wasn't raided while we were gone, but unfortunately there was some type of bug with the sleeping bags which allowed the previous base owners to keep using them even though we picked them up. So every time we would leave, there was the potential danger of people logging in, grabbing guns, and waiting for us. To counter this, we tried to move as many guns as we could down into the bunker where they wouldn't be able to access, and that way if they spawned in, they would basically be stuck in an open room. If you remember from the attempted raid earlier, we believed that there were two groups fighting over this base. So it was the original people that lived here, and there were other names from a completely different team. And we believed that this team was probably the same base that we saw earlier on in this adventure just down the hill. So since it was getting late and Frankie logged out for the night, Chopper, Baba, and I went down there to see that base and find out if it was indeed them. Oh, wait, did it get raided? Oh, it makes it easier for us, doesn't it? Yeah, garage is full raided. There's gun in the ground in here. So they took their vehicle. Oh, yeah, yeah. This was recent, though. This isn't even that loaded. I'm glad we didn't raid it. I mean, it could have I mean, been. They lift, the, they lift charcoal and jump out of behind. Oh, wow. Oh, this is a code lock. This is a code lock right here. Yeah. This is huge. Maybe they didn't even raid this. This didn't even seem like a hard raid, to be honest. It wasn't. It really wasn't. There's like a couple of doors, Max. Maybe they like raided this and then they just kept going towards our base. Ah. But we stopped them. Yeah. Maybe, yeah. Uh, you could be right. Nothing. Nothing. We originally thought that the people living in this base were most likely the ones that tried to raid us, but now we saw that that was probably not true. It looked like our search was going to have to carry on. Maybe in the next day we would find them, or they'd even find us again. For now, it was getting late though, so we just went back to base and logged out for the night. The next morning we got on, hopeful to finish building up our base, but once we actually logged in, we saw a site that nobody ever wants to see in DayZ. A half-empty base. From what we could conclude, the raiders must have come back in the middle of the night and finished the attack, and unfortunately we were offline so we couldn't defend. I didn't log out with anything, which was a pretty stupid move, but Chopper had a few base building supplies left on him, so we could at least reseal the base and decide what we would do next. Hey, we got one gun rack here, man. Okay, okay. <laughs> you know, one thing I realized on the server is they will online you, get slammed, and they will come back. Yeah. At five yeah. in the morning, every time. The past like oh, six yeah. times we played on the server, this is what happens. I know. But we've got a clue to go off, man. Look. What? They scrapped their name in the wall. Oh, yeah. Uh huh. You know what we could do, though? We could just farm without greenhouses. I just thought of that. Do they let you build like regular garden plots? Yeah, yeah, I think so. That might just be easier, man. Make like a full field in here. Doesn't look good though, does it? Ah, uh, no, but like I said, it saves us 300k. Yeah, true. And I think it gets watered through the rocks. Like, they should get all watered. Perfect. Oh, yeah. The base was sealed off for now, and we took some time to plant some crops. We didn't do this to get food, but we did this so that we could sell these tomatoes and other vegetables to make a lot of money. Professional Daisy farmer. <laughs> it is my specialty, man. <laughs> I think in like eight minutes or so, we'll have some tomatoes. Oh, we still, oh. <laughs> you cut the time? 
While we let the tomatoes grow, we worked on the base a little bit more and added some more defensive improvements. In fact, we were going to design this entire base around our farming operation, as you would soon see. If we could successfully grow here at a large scale, we'd be able to buy back everything we lost from the raid and more. I'm going to lie, we need a... <sighs> Frankie here, man. Yeah, this is where Frankie would tell us uh, a war story or where... something. Yeah. Or his like world travels. While we let the next batch of tomatoes grow, we went out for a loot run, and on the way, we saw an opportunity to get some much needed supplies. Greenville? Hey, we could hit extract and might be able to get that. Where the, the drop at, though? That's uh, still in the sky. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's, dude, that's in like the. It's such an easy spot. Coincidentally, this airdrop was right down the hill from that base that we stole a gyrocopter from earlier. As I was approaching the airdrop, I could also hear them parking an entire new heli inside of their base, so they definitely bought a new one. There was a good chance that we would run into these guys down at this drop. I see up toward their base. Oh, they have a hangar, I think, now. I think that's what I'm looking at. Yeah, probably. Oh, yeah. oh a hangar. hangar. Yeah, yeah, a hangar for the heli. I don't want to lose it again. Oh, there's a guy running in the field uh, between me and... Oh, yeah, I see him, I see him, I see him. Yeah, I see him, I see him. I see him, I see him. I see him. You hit him. Oh, you hit him. you hit him. Yeah, you hit him. Oh my god, he just <laughs> exploded. Yeah, that was, a, yeah. <laughs> that was a crazy shot. Oh, this guy's got a GMC prototype. What? What's up? Yeah, yeah. Is that the best it's gun? Like in the VSS. Yeah, it's like a VSS thing. I think of one shots. C4. What? Oh, nice. SA58. This guy's name is. Oh, it's Forge. <laughs> Wait, what's this key? Jamocopter keys. Oh, no, shot, dude. Oh, no. Yeah, way. Way. You, just oh, you, got C4, right? you got C4, right? I do got a homemade off that, yeah. Oh, dude, we could just blow hanging and take the, the fucking gyro. Uh, I'm not against that. Oh, bro, we can easily get in there, I think. Mm, I think that's the one that was open, yeah. I looked up, I seen a door open, like a big hat. Yeah, uh, no, I, I saw I saw him close it. But that's tier two, the top of it. I'm just letting you know. Is it? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's not oh. loaded. Oh, we not got a heavy? No, I just got a homemade. <sighs> After identifying where these guys kept their helicopter, we made a plan to try and raid it. Now, right now, we only got one homemade off of that airdrop, but we had a few more back at base. However, our base was on the entire opposite side of the map, which would make it quite the hike to get over there and back. On the way back, we stopped to check the airfield, but we weren't so lucky with finding any C4. We only got into a few encounters and then carried on our way. After going home, grabbing what we needed, and then coming back, it looked like these guys had taken their heli back out for a spin, leaving the hangar door wide open. This was a perfect chance for us to try and set up an ambush. It would be so easy to sit there and catch them, bro, but like, he, they could have a guy home. Yeah, yeah, I'm on the roof right now. This is big, actually. Yeah. Where'd you go I'm from? Yeah. yeah, you can see my red bag. Yeah, so the problem, we'd have to raid the hatch now, but they're going to see it when they come to Yeah, land. hatch it. No, 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 no. Like, by the time they see it, it's going to be too late. Like, they'll get like, sprayed they'll out. Like, kill them and then... Yeah, 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 that's the idea. It's like, I spray them out, they don't kill see one, it, yeah, yeah, like that. Yeah, that's my thing. I'm just gonna barrel one. I'm literally just gonna barrel one from glass, like as soon as he lands, and then he's gonna rush out and free kills. Okay, okay. Let me Bob will be waiting. Yeah. Yeah, and you two are are in there. Yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, it's tier two window. Yeah. Many of you are probably wondering why we don't just raid this door and enter the base, and that's because it's actually unraidable. You see, on the server you can only raid through doors, and these guys took a window and tilted it sideways, making it a functional door, but it was unraidable. Their main entrance that had actual doors was on the other side, and there must have been like 10 or 15 gates at least, so we couldn't raid it anyway. Our plan with this trap was that they would fly home and then Chopper would kill them from their heli before they even saw the exploded hatch. And then, once they respawned to their sleeping bags, they would come back out to try and kill Chopper, and we'd catch them at this door, hopefully getting all of their gear. Now we just have to wait for them to get back. Oh. What? Is that the, oh. is that the airdrop? Oh. No, no, that's the, that's yeah, the help. You Let me know. God, if this is him, I'm gonna cry. I don't know when to peek. Oh, that's, him. that's gotta be him. Are you shooting at me? No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Get ready, get ready. Yeah, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. It's flowing in the air. 
You killed both? I don't know. Maybe one. I'm just gonna leave him there. Okay. Is that Heli just flying up in the sky? It is. It's just flying away. <laughs> We're gonna go track it down later. <laughs> it's gone. Unless it's in the ocean. It's gone like way north, bro. It's gone. Yeah, we just gotta kind of sit still now and hope they come out. I'll just hold the outside. There's a guy running behind him. Two guys. Oh, I killed them both, I think. Because there's one guy running behind him. Oh, you might have then. Yeah, I guess I did. Oh. No, no. Oh, what? It was so fast. We couldn't have even ran in. There's no way. He f***ed up leaving the, the base. Yeah, I know. How do you do that? Only our luck will he f*** up leaving the base, man. Double click it. Can't make this shit up, man. We stuck around for a while longer, but these guys didn't want to come outside for obvious reasons. They tried to wall bang us, but after they noticed we weren't going to leave, they deployed gas grenades, and at that point, we just called it quits. Although Chopper did kill both of the guys in the helicopter, it flew off north on its own, and we weren't sure where it landed. Losing the heli after getting so close to going deep on this base and failing was quite a tough loss, but it wouldn't be long until we would find another a helicopter and this one was parked at an apartment way up north would you jump into that window somehow how do you guys do this yeah you, you, you bolt up on the oh, uh, on, on the top shade. of the door right yeah 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 oh no shit i can't believe i didn't realize that first thing i saw when i came here i literally didn't realize that i went to the the other side windows and i didn't <laughs> think of this holy here we are at the top Oh, look at that. Give me good news, fellas. All right. Oh. Okay, okay. What got here? Flags here. Uh, oh, they're fucking locked, man. That's fine. It's unlocked? Uh, oh. It's unlocked, but there's not the parts. Maybe they're inside then. We broke into the locked storage below and got some decent stuff out of it. It wasn't anything crazy, but for the amount of doors that we raided through, it wasn't too bad. We got some useful keys out of it, and of course, we went back to Trader and bought parts to take off with this heli. After parking up the heli, it was time to head back to base and finally get this farm completed. To destroy the crops down there, man. <laughs> it's like Minecraft. It's gonna, yeah, it's gonna bring the crops. I've already got 120 fucking tomatoes. <laughs> okay. Yeah, not bad. Wow. No way. This is awesome. Okay. Yeah, come down here and look at the view. It looks beautiful. Oh, that's nice. Like Minecraft? <laughs> Imagine we're getting raided. Everyone get down. Yeah. That's what I'm get saying. The, like, get the tomatoes. Hold this <laughs> You'll never see them. All right. Now it's time for the harvest. You got that? Yeah. Oh, come on, buddy. I gotta make another sandwich. <laughs> uh, all right, everybody pick a row. Off of this run alone, we got hundreds and hundreds of tomatoes that we would go on to later sell the trader for about $600,000. And this was just the first of many future runs that we would be able to do using this base. It was such a well-hidden spot and the amount of dirt that we could dig up inside was perfect for us to make millions. Going forward, we'd be able to buy whatever we wanted and pretty much do whatever we wanted. Not many people even knew we lived here except for the people that raided us. There we go. Good business. Nice doing business with you, man. Meantime, Chopper is sleeping the whole time upstairs. Crazy. Okay. Yep, doing absolutely nothing. It's all right. We'll do it ourselves. All right, guys, that's pretty much the end of our adventure on Derail here. I intended on adding more footage of us farming and doing cell runs, but it turns out that I forgot to record the next few hours of gameplay, so unfortunately, I couldn't add that to conclude this video. But if you watched this far, thank you so much. And as always, I'll catch you in the next adventure.